a horrific scene after a night out in downtown Sacramento. A barrage of gunfire ripping through the crowded sidewalks, drawing nearby officers to the scene. Multiple victim CPR is in progress. Officers nearby, hearing the gunshots, rush to help the victims. Around 2 a.m. this morning, officers heard gunshots near 10th Street and K Street and saw people running. They were on scene almost immediately. We were running. This lady went down. I guess she got hit in the leg, like right across from us. Bystanders running for their lives. All we heard was just gunshots, at least automatic gun. Um, after that, we heard gunshots fired back. The shooting taking place shortly after 2 a.m. when bars in downtown Sacramento were closing after a busy Saturday night. The victims' families waking up to the tragic news and now searching for answers. Pamela Harris lost her son Sergio. It's crazy. And I, I, I'm just to the point right now, I don't know what to do. I don't even think this is real. I feel like it's a dream. Sacramento's mayor offering support to the families. This is a senseless and unacceptable tragedy. And I emphasize the word unacceptable. Sacramento police now asking witnesses to submit videos while acknowledging some of those shared on social media appear to show a fight that preceded the gunfire. It is unclear if the fight was related to the shooting. And Guad joins me now from the scene. It's still an active investigation. Guad, what more have you learned? Kate, just minutes ago, Sacramento police informed of the six that died. Three were adult men, three were adult women. They've also recovered at least one stolen handgun, and they now know there were multiple shooters at the scene. Kate. All right. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.